Hi everybody, this is Big Mama Sag from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone is trying their hardest to be as fabulous as possible right now. I know I am. I don't look so fabulous though. <laughs> but I never do really. Anyway, it's a new season. Happy birthday again to my Aries brothers and sisters. So, being at a new season and we're moving into year two here at Firesign Tarot, we're going to start doing something a little different now. Once a week, more than likely, it's going to be read on a Sunday night or a Monday morning, depending on what I got going on. You're going to get your work week top and bottom by the elements. The 12 zodiac signs are divided up into four elements. In each one of those four elements, the three zodiac signs within it have a tendency to share tendencies, attributes, energies, good and bad habits, things of that nature. So, why not read you together? You, you know, we're all going through the same stuff right now, more or less. So, sorry, my phone just buzzed. Anywho, these readings are going to be general. They're not going to resonate with everybody. If they resonate with you, okay, cool. Cheer free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it doesn't resonate, throw it out altogether. Ignore it. Pretend it didn't happen. I, being a Sagittarius, am really good at that, by the way. Some of you are not. Stay tuned to the end. And kind of give a little listen to maybe your moon rising or your Venus signs, if you feel so compelled. If you don't have that kind of time on your hands, that's okay. Watch it again later in the week. Watch it again on Friday to see if it happened. Do what you want. It's your journey, not mine. And I'm kicking the ball around that maybe on like a Thursday night or a Friday we'll do your weekend top or bottom three. We're going to see what happens. If this is popular, I'll do the weekend top and bottom. Or top three or bottom three. I don't know. I'm still trying to work that spread out. Anyway, I'm going to shut my pie hole and throw some cards down. Fire signs, you're first. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Top and bottom. Hmm. Nine of Swords reversed, Queen of Wands reversed. Speaking of trying not to think about something. <laughs> trying not to think about something or overthink something, trying to put something out of your head. And things are at a standstill. You might be losing passion for something right now. Losing that lust for life. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. One, two, three. One, two, three. What are we going to do about that? Okay. What do you need to concentrate on? Very good. Okay. Six of Wands. Through whatever you're going through right now, I, I see victory at the end of the battle. I really do. I think everything is going to be okay. Try to avoid situations of conflict. So, fire signs. My brothers and sisters, I know we struggle with this. We're angry people. I don't know why. It's like our go-to emotion. I don't know why. Avoid situations of conflict. Three of Wands. Wait it out. See what's going to happen. Don't jump the gun. Because we're good at that, too. Don't do it. Just wait it out. See what's going to happen. Seven of Wands reversed. Anyone fighting any kind of internal battle right now? Anyone, anyone? I know I am. A lot of internal struggles going on. Of course, i got a lot of crap going on, other than what's going on in the world right now. But if things feel a little bit out of control, you are the only one really who can kind of put them back in control. Yeah, the universe throws stuff at us all the time. It's what you do with it is what matters. It's how you react to it. So just 
these two guys hanging out. Just watch your reaction. Make logical decisions. King of Swords. Don't do something based on emotion. And I know it's very hard for a fire sign to not live in the moment. You need to step out of the moment for a second. Okay? Just for a second. Paraffant. There's life lessons to be learned here. There is. There's a lesson in all of this for everyone, and it is up to us to figure out what that is. But don't overthink it. Just try to rest and regain your passion. Fire signs, it's going to be okay. Okay, everything's going to be fine. It's going to be a good week. There is victory coming for you. You just have to make the logical decisions and avoid situations of conflict and wait it out. Okay? Earth! Taurus Virgo Capricorn! One. Do, 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 do. Two. Three. Four. Oh my goodness. These are stiff. They're still practically new. I had to replace my uh, Tarot Illuminati because I lost a card somewhere in the void, and I have no idea where it went. So, well, this is the third time on my hands I got. Um, we're going to be doing some deep cleaning this week. And since my son's home to help, you know. All right, one more. Get you on the table. Do, 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 Top and bottom. Yes. Some of the ones are reversed in the temperance. Another sign or set of signs that really hates it when things are out of control. Hmm. You feel a little out of control, but you're being patient. You're trying to stay balanced. You're trying to keep things flowing. That's good. You guys are good at that. Earth signs are very good at being down to earth and finding the light at the end of the tunnel. You probably prepared for this in some way, shape, form, or fashion. You were ready. Not like us fire signs who waited to the last minute to do everything. Guilty. All right, top and bottom. Excellent. Oh, Nine of Swords. Some of you are not resting. Nine of Swords, Three of Wands reversed, the Wheel of Fortune, the World, the Emperor, the Eight of Cups reversed. Oh boy. Upward turns of events, endings of old cycles. Some of you, you're not showing it, but you're freaking out a little. You gotta stop freaking out. Don't go bat crap bonkers about anything this week. Just maintain. Maintain. Breathe. Get rest. Three of Wands reversed. A clarifier on that. Five of Swords. Okay. You're going to pick the pieces up. Whatever's going on right now, whatever ships might not be coming in, you will pick the pieces up. You will be victorious at the end of the battle. But things may have to change in the short term. There is an upward turn of events coming. I'm feeling like a giving and receiving thing. Clarifier. Star card reverse. You're not going to get what you wanted, but you're going to get what you needed. The universe is going to make sure of that. 
Clarifier on the wheel, Eight of Swords. Don't get all wrapped up in the ending because when things come to an end, beautiful new beginnings come. Don't ever forget that. The Emperor card, you are in charge. You are large and in charge. You got this. You got this all figured out. Clarifier on the Eight of Cups, Ten of Wands. It may benefit you this week to reconnect with some old friends, possibly, and resolve any old burdens. If any of you have any issues with anyone, particularly a water sign or a fire sign person, that you need to work out, it may benefit you to work that out this week. This might be what's been keeping you up at night. I don't know. I'm not you. But, anywho, that's that for your signs. Error. I like you. Okay. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. just want to talk. They're trying to fall out of the deck. Normally on a Monday morning, I'd be going into work at 7 a.m. Today, I'm going in at 9.30. Normally, I'd be getting out at 5. I'm getting out at 4. I don't mind short days. As long as I don't have to do it for too long. <laughs> it's all good. Everything's going to work out. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Top and bottom. Top and bottom. Five of Swords and the Four of Wands reversed. Oh, wow. Things are changing. You may feel like doors are closing. Some of you may feel a little bit shut in. Oh, I like it. Okay. Hmm. Page of Pentacles reversed. Magician, Two of Swords reversed. Seven of Pentacles, Nine of Cups in the upright, Ten of Wands in the upright. Okay. Air signs, you're in a rare position right now. I would be extremely careful what you wish for and what you manifest into your life. I would be very careful of what comes out of your mouth and what pops in your head. Just a warning. Positive vibes only. Positive thoughts only. Period. Don't manifest any bad stuff into your life. Please. Things may be slowing down right now. You may find it hard to see the light at the end of the tunnel. But trust me, the light's there. You just have to take the blindfold off. There's a forest in them trees, I promise. Really, there is. Clarifier. Queen of Pentacles reverse. Mm, okay, okay. Some of you may be feeling a little bit codependent on other people right now. Don't be afraid to ask for help if you need it. It's okay, especially in times like this. Seven of Pentacles. Patience is key. Things will fruit. Things will prosper. Things will come back into line. You just have to be patient. And I know, air signs, um, probably some of the most patient people. Most of the time, but you have your moments just like everybody else. I'm raising a little air sign out there right now. 
and he has to be the most impatient child on the planet. But it's because he's nine. And he's an only child. And he's used to getting all the attention. So I want what I want. I want it now. But he has an Aries moon. And I think most of his... I want what I want and I want it now. And his impatience is his Aries moon. Not trying to put you on blast, Aries. But you're not the most patient people in the world. Anywho. Nine of Cups. You may just need to chill, relax, and find emotional fulfillment at this time clarifier seven of wands yeah you're in control of your own emotions right now you're in control of what you manifest absolutely clarifier on the ten of wands three of wands reversed if you have any again just like just like the uh, earth signs if you have any burdens that you need to put to an end don't wait Anything you need to get off your chest, don't wait. Now is the time. Okay? I think we got that. Don't let yourself be so boxed in. Things are changing very rapidly in the world right now. Don't get boxed in by it. Water! Alright, water signs and then we're done. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Top and bottom. High Priestess and the Three Swords. Hmm. Some of you may be dealing with a broken heart. And some of you may have seen it coming. Could have been some secrets involved. You could have found some things out. You could have used your intuition and figured something out. Take it over resonates. What do you do about it? Queen of Cups in the upright, Devil reversed, Nine of Cups reversed, Five of Wands in the upright, King of Wands, and the Four of Wands in the reverse. Y'all might be dealing with fire sign, just saying. The three fire sign cards right in a row. And one of them's a king. Y'all may well be dealing with fire sign. I also have Capricorn. I have Pisces. Aquarius. I can't remember the High Priestess. Taurus! Could be a Taurus. My brain, I haven't had enough coffee yet. I'm sorry. I sense a deep, profound love. You have a deep emotion for someone around. Maybe that's why you're so heartbroken. fire on that devil. Ten of cups. Oh, wow. You may feel someone pulling away from you for whatever reason. But with the ten of cups, completion of a cycle, you need to rest. You just chill out about it. I don't think they're necessarily disconnecting from you, but they may be dis disconnecting from other things. They may be processing other things. The devil doesn't have to be a bad card. It's just how you read it. And right now I'm seeing this as positive. They're working through some stuff. I think this deep emotion is very mutual.
You just need to chill out. You need to disconnect from the negative thoughts in your own mind in regards to this situation. Clarify on the Nine of Cups reversed. Three of Wands reversed. Uh, you may be dealing with a fire sign. Be careful what you fill your cups with this week. Don't let old nasty habits come crawling back in. Magician. I'm hearing don't wait at the dock for the ship. Knight of Swords reversed. Don't be peeking in on somebody else's social media. Don't go stalking somebody to find out what they're doing. Just ask them. Communicate. Talk. Initiate conversation. Or don't initiate conversation. It's your journey, not mine. If you want to manifest it, manifest it. Don't sit there crying in your beer. Five of Wands. Conflict. Distance yourself from situations that may involve conflict. Again, someone's working through something here. You need to let them work through it. Don't push it. King of Wands. Need a clarifier. The Strength card. Okay. <coughs> another fire sign card but I have cancer here I have Capricorn I have Aries eight of pentacles and the strength card on top of the king of wands okay Put the work into you and things that you are passionate about and move forward with your own life and deal with your own inner demons and don't try to deal with theirs. Let them work on their base, you work on yours. For whoever that resonates with. Four of Wands reversed, clarifier, page of wands. Doors closing, things coming to a screeching halt, judgment. Some of you may be making a judgment call this week as to whether you want to move forward with a relationship. Or it doesn't even have to be a relationship, it could just be something. I'm sensing relationship though. Be very careful with the judgment call you make, water signs. Again, they're working through some stuff. And I see there to be the potential to be beautiful and prosperous. You just have to take a break. Maybe some of you are taking a break this week. I don't know. Social distancing is being hard on everybody right now. Just saying. Okay. This has been it. Let me know what you think. Let me know if it resonates. All right. I will be back thursday night maybe friday morning with your weekend top and bottom this has been your work week top and bottom i hope you enjoyed it thanks for coming by and we'll catch you guys thursday or friday Bye for now. oh stay tuned for the rest of the individual zodiac readings as they come out over the next week see you soon bye